in the beginning of time, actually more accurately, before oh, close my legs right away here, before time was even created by man, there existed source. Complete, whole, with no separation. And source wanted to experience itself. But source couldn't experience itself without doing something or creating something separate from itself. Without creating contrast. Because if you have no contrast, there's no separation. A white circle is a white circle. But if you create contrast, you have a dark side and you have a light side. And now you have contrast. Source couldn't experience itself as long as it stayed as one. It had to have another vantage point to look back at itself and to look the other way. So it created separation. It created light and dark. And it allowed the dark, in some respects, to forget that it was really light. Because if the dark remembered and knew that it was light, they would always, it would always know that it was light. So how could it really embody separateness? So the darkness chose to forget that it was really another aspect of light. The contrast created. And Source released that to be manifest in this thing that we call the world. So Source needed a vessel for this wonderful play to play out. So it created you. And you. And you. And you. To experience itself. To experience itself. To play a role in creating contrast so it can experience itself. And you showed up. And it, it, it created the strategy before darkness chose to forget it. And it said, what we're going to do is, and darkness volunteered to do this. Darkness said, okay, I'll forget. I will choose to forget who I really am so that you and I can enjoy the awesome, luscious, luscious pleasure of discovery. Because what makes a game or a play exciting is you don't know how it's going to end. If you know how it's going to end, it takes all the lusciousness out of it, right? So darkness said, I'll forget who I am. So I and we can enjoy the magnificence of remembering. So we can enjoy the wonderment of watching what has become separate and separateness and contrast come back together. And we will do that through these vessels called you.